Looking forward to it, Dave. Thank you very much. While many people might be dreaming of a white Christmas, the winter weather before the holiday could make things tough for travelers. WBZ's Lisa Greshi shows us many are concerned about the coming storm. Passengers getting to the airport to wait in these long lines to make sure they got to where they needed to go for the holidays before the storm. Definitely the snow and uh, the lines too. Matthew Sierzega wasn't taking any chances when it came to his family getting back to Denver in time for Christmas. He bumped their flight up more than five hours. Because of snow and all that. Something is, is going to snow out here and it's going to snow in Denver too, so there might be a lot of delays. And just because it was early, passengers like Lucy Haar from Wisconsin soon realized that didn't mean they were beating the rush. Very busy. Uh, my flight left uh, Milwaukee was a 5.30 departure. I thought, oh, it'll be really easy, but it was not. It was um, everybody's heading out. Lucy hoping her Santa hat will bring her better luck with the drive to Maine ahead of her. But for six-year-old Melania Darianani and her family, Christmas came early. Her parents waited until they were in line to tell her where they were off to. So what did your mom just tell you? Of then I'm going to Disney World. That surprise overshadowing any other travel concerns. We just packed our bags and we're hopeful. We heard the snow was going to come around 8 in the morning and lucky to plan a flight early enough. So uh, just wait it out like everyone else and we'll get there. Can you say Merry Christmas? Merry Christmas. Now, because these lines are long, you should get to the airport at least two hours before your flight, no matter how close to the airport you may live. Reporting in Logan, Lisa Greshi, WBC News. Excellent.